guys, Azenium here, and today we are playing to survive a plane crash on fire. Um, I will be showing you, and it's tutorial time. <laughs> uh, it's extremely old. Uh, so basically, what you want to do is take this down to right about this point right here okay and then it might take you a couple tries you want to jump down okay and fall now I spam a I don't know if that actually does anything okay there we go look at that so that means we've done it right now if you've done it wrong you end up sticking into the bottom of the uh, ground okay so you're gonna want to make your way over to the island and I'm not sure why the original developer of this left this in here. Uh, do I uh, recommend you do this? No, probably not. <coughs> uh, but I just wanted to point it out as a flaw in the game, so we'll only do it once or twice. That way we don't impact anyone else's... Um, gameplay basically <clears throat> so we're going to make our way over to the island it takes a little bit uh, make sure not to hit any of these blocks just in case they're on fire uh, because if that happens then you have to start the process all over from step one which is not cool And it's best if you get it the first time. So, okay, here we go. So, what you want to do is go over <coughs> and grab this badge right here. So you spawn down at the bottom. That way you don't have to worry about uh, having to come back down here. So just jump on this and then you get it. And then come over here to this and this, okay? So what you want to get, what you want to go to is the anchor tool, okay? So go to here, go to the plane, and then you're going to use, you're going to go in the plane, and you're going to use the anchor tool on the window, alright? Just like that. Hopefully I did it right, because it's hard to tell in this game at all. You'll know if you did it right if you see flaming stuff coming through. If I didn't do it right, then we'll have to try and do it again, but I think I did it right. Well, he okay, let's see. Yep, so I did do it right. See how things are coming through? So now the entire plane is anchored down, and essentially you basically have complete control of the plane. Uh, the only issue is, now I can't get back to here. Okay, here we go. So now the entire plane is on fire. Which means you can unanchor it at any point and it will jettison forward like so and then just as you're going forward and falling you can then stop the plane again if you want just like that and see how that gigantic block came forward and it uh now i'm completely on fire so if you want the the uh plane is definitely getting kind of a rubber band effect so you're going to be stuck into a wall like this and we'll probably die but you can uh, fool around with this and do a bunch of different things. Like I said, I don't really recommend using this exploit because it kind of breaks the game. Um, the plane will respawn, so don't worry too much about it. But as you can see, the plane is stuck up there in the sky. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's just parts are just disintegrating off of it. So there's that. <clears throat> uh, that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Uh, I don't know many games that have an exploit like this. Uh, I try not to exploit any games at all on this game, on uh, Roblox in general. But when I do see them, um, I do at least try and reach out to the developer and say, Hey, you know, uh, your game's broken. <laughs> But this game is so old, uh, this is one of the original Roblox games, so 
uh, not a lot of people care. And like I said, we won't we won't do it anymore. I just wanted people to be aware. If the plane is not moving, I uh, well that was strange. If the plane is not moving, basically, you're going to just want to uh, leave the game and rejoin a different server because there's probably someone uh, locking the plane down with the anchor tool. Alright, that's all I have for you guys today. Also, there's a graphical bug before I leave, uh, real quick, uh, where you can anchor someone's foot to the ground, and it is the funniest thing ever. See? Okay, so they're fine. Uh, it's a graphical bug. Uh, I, I tried it with a friend to see, but it, it is pretty hilarious looking, I will say. Um, it is pretty funny. So, and then, um, yeah, so. Which is strange, because you can actually stand on them. But I was told it's a graphical bug. Uh, not too big of a deal. Uh, there, so. There's no anchoring of players down to the ground. Um, anyways, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you in the next part of this Roblox series of uh, good games and apparently random exploits that I find very bizarre. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys. <clears throat> hey guys, Azenium here and Bella's back here again with us. Don't forget to donate for improved content. Click on the bell icon, subscribe, and like the video. I hope you enjoyed the content. Thanks for watching.